Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, as you can tell by the title, I am going to be covering up my black eye with drugstore makeup. I've already had my makeup done and I'll be doing my makeup, so I've actually filmed this intro after I did my makeup. So I'm gonna be showing you before pictures and what it looks like as I'm doing my makeup and how I achieved this look and I explain how exactly I got this big shiner on my face and luckily um, I think I did an okay job of covering it up so I feel more comfortable going out in public and it's been almost a week so it was uh, Monday, no it's been five days. <laughs> And it's still pretty dark and red. All fun and games until someone gets hurt. But my first reaction was just to laugh. I had my camera out. I actually had my camera on me. I was just lucky enough that it didn't hit my camera. It hit my face. Um, but my first reaction was just to laugh laugh hysterically. Um, if you guys are interested to see how I'm going to achieve this look, please continue to watch until the end of the video. Okay guys, so here's the stitch, here's the story. So I was playing ball with my kids the other day. Um, my daughter, she got a baseball glove and a baseball for her birthday. And of course we decided to test it out and play outside in the yard. And my husband and her were playing with the ball and then I decided to throw the ball back and forth between me and my husband and I get hit in the face. So as you can tell by the title of the video and the intro, I am going to try to show you how I'm covering this up. I'm going to insert a picture of a before because I already have one layer of foundation on and I'm sitting in front of my window to get natural light and you can kind of see Maybe I'll just try to wipe some of it off. You can kind of see um, what it looks like. See there. And that's still with foundation on my face, but I'll insert some pictures just so you can see. So I'm just going to um, use the makeup that I have from the drugstore and go from there. So I'm just using um, the phys Physician's Formula Foundation, the Healthy Skin Foundation. And so I'm gonna go ahead, put this on and just add some more. And really focus it on this part. The bruise, right now it's all red and yellow and blue. It starts like in the corner of my eye, it goes all the way down like to here, cause like this is where I get hit with the ball in my face, but it was a very unfortunate situation. I actually, I'm just gonna get my beauty blender and blend this all in, and it's dirty from the first coat that I did. Um, we were catching the ball and I was throwing it and I was catching it and it was kind of sunny. I had my sunglasses on, so I think that's what made it um, even worse and by no fault to my husband but um he has you know a bigger throw than i do he's a lot stronger than i am so he was just trying to throw it to me and i didn't catch it <laughs> so that's what happened but i don't mind going out with a black eye on my face but it's nice to be able to cover it up and just go from there. Okay, so technically this is coat number two and what I'm going to do and what I don't always do is I'm going to be putting on a couple coats of the foundation and concealer. I have the Maybelline Age Rewind uh, Erase Dark Circle concealer. Uh, it's like a brightening concealer, so I'm going to use that along with the foundation, but I'm actually going to set each layer of foundation and concealer as I go. So I'm going to put a layer and then powder. I don't normally do this through my everyday um, foundation, but today 
I'm going to, I find that it's going to help to build it up. it for the video if you like this type of video it's kind of different from what I've done before um, just give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more videos like this please subscribe to my channel because I will be making more videos and posting them hopefully on a regular basis so you guys can look out for that and thank you for watching and have a good day bye